Dan Shackman won the advanced prize in Nobel Chemistry in 2011 for the discovery of physical quasi-periodic crystals. My desk, working on my computer, and the telephone rings, and it said, Danny speaking. Can you hear me? And uh, the voice says, hello. <laughs> this is the World Swedish Academy of Sciences. Please hold the line. Very important message. I say, uh oh, oh. <laughs> Once a year, Dan Checkman returns to Ames Lab to visit and to teach. We managed to sit down with him for an interview. <clears throat> My name is Dan Checkman. Um, I'm a member of uh, Iowa State University. And usually I live in Israel. I am a uh, distinguished professor of the Technion in Haifa, Israel. The, my field is material science. I've been teaching many years material science and did a lot of research in different aspects of material science. Well, of course, um, the, the Nobel Prize is the ultimate recognition of uh, a scientific achievement, and um, it affects everybody who received it. How did it affect me? Well, as before, I was known as a good scientist, but and, and I traveled internationally, moderately. But after the prize, I was invited everywhere around the world to give talks, to meet students, professors, decision makers in different countries. I met many presidents of countries, including several in the United States. Um, and uh, my life became by far more versatile and interesting. I think that if a country would like to establish itself 30 years from now as leading in science, they should start teaching science in kindergartens. I want them to understand the world around them. I want young people to think logically so that in the future nobody can stick nonsense into their hands. Mm -hmm. I want them to think in analytical terms, knowing this and this, this means that it can happen, or no, it cannot happen, based on understanding of nature. My discovery was sheer luck, but it is based on being a good professional. So you have to be ready so that when you see something different, you know it's different. And, and, and you have to be ready for it. So you have to be a good scientist to realize that, hey, this is different. <laughs> <laughs>